Two recruits so far during the transfer window. Now Paul Jewell must decide whether to throw his Scandinavian signing straight into an FA Cup tie at Portsmouth. We'll have to assess his fitness, but you know, at the moment the squad is really was really stretched with injuries, so uh, we might we might have to put him in earlier than, than we than possibly we'd like. We're going to enter the tie off the back of five successive Premiership defeats, but with three of them against Manchester United, Chelsea, and Arsenal, Jewell is keeping things in perspective. We have been a bit unfortunate the last uh, three of the last five games of being against the teams he just said we we'll probably occupy a first, second, and third in the Premiership. Um, so, and and two of those games, Arsenal and Chelsea, we de definitely should have got something out of two games. So this, it's not all doom and gloom. But the Premiership remains the priority, but with nine goals conceded in three games, Jewel is looking for a dramatic defensive improvement. We can see the goals from set pieces, and I feel a lot of it's down to lack of concentration, communication, and a little bit of confidence. You know, in the games, Blackburn like first half now we were a better team. You know, for the long periods of the Arsenal game, we were a better team. Second half against Chelsea, we were a better team. But in all those periods of when we were the better team, we still managed to concede the goal. Emil Heskey will carry much of the burden up front. Four key players, including Henri Camera, remain injured, but Jewel is boosted by Lee McCulloch's return from suspension.